So now we're going to take a look at uh, the trace header itself. So all requests are traced up to a configurable minimum. And after reaching that minimum, a percentage of the requests are traced uh, to uh, avoid unnecessary costs. Okay. Uh, the sampling decision and the trace ID are added to the HTTP request in uh, in tracing headers name X Amazon trace ID. So we were talking about the, the trace ID gets set, but this is just what it looks like. So the first X-ray integrated service that the request hits is when the, the tracing header gets added. So here, this is what it looks like. It has a root and it has uh, a sampled number there. And then the next thing is uh, if you have a tracer header where it's originating from an actual instrument and application. It could actually have this parent uh, thing here as well. You don't really need to remember this stuff for the exam. I'm just showing it to you. Um, but just understand that the trace header determines whether this will show up in the in the um, in the trace or not. And it's going to be based off that sample number that is assigned to it.